Tonight, the Fort Collins City Council expected to give final approval to so-called body cameras for police officers. 7 News photojournalist Major King takes a look at how those cameras could help solve crime while protecting the officers. They are seemingly everywhere these days. Security cameras in public squares, cell phones capturing video for instant upload, even traffic cameras documenting red light runners. This is a point of view style camera. So. And now a taser Axon Flex body camera may be recording your every move and word while interacting with Fort Collins police. This is not a new concept. Fort Collins Police Services has been running cameras since 1992. It's just the mobility of it is a change. By day, Old Town Square is a great place to shop and have lunch. By late at night, well, that can be another story. We like it for a couple of reasons. One, we think that the camera does an excellent job of collecting evidence. We also see it as an accountability piece, both for citizen accountability and employee or police officer accountability. All video recorded is kept a minimum of seven days on up to 180 days for a traffic offense and even longer for more serious crimes. It's a big part of transparency. It's a big part of why we have these cameras is um, so that citizens can feel comfortable in their interactions with the police. Christensen says the cameras would have been helpful in documenting the Fort Collins riot earlier this year. The officers who are currently wearing them, uh, I can't get them away from them. They want these cameras. They, they see the benefit for these cameras. In Fort Collins, Major King, 7 News. So what does it cost? Well, each camera costs about $50 a month based on a five-year contract, and they have unlimited data storage. Fort Collins would become the largest agency in Colorado to use this technology if that $180,000 price tag is approved tonight.